Hey guys, how's it going? It is kind of a cloudy day today. It's supposed to be raining, currently, but it's not. So I think I'm in the clear. <laughs> um, it says that there's like a 50% chance of rain in the next like 20 minutes, but the clouds have looked exactly the same all day long. So I'm thinking that I'm good to go. Meaning that today's project is dealing with this mess. <laughs> um, we have totally neglected this patio area pretty much since we moved in here. Uh, it, it's bad. And then Brent just got a new job and he's now working remote and he wants to be able to come outside. But um, it's a mess. It's just, it's not great. I mean, there's just stuff absolutely everywhere and it's just ridiculous. And so I'm going to clean it up and I ordered some new patio furniture. The last box should be here today. So we're gonna start by removing the table, removing the chairs, they're going, they're gone, um, they're, they've, the paint is starting to chip off of them and so there's a little bit of rust on them and honestly like the cushions are just old and like, I mean look at that. <laughs> Does that not just scream high class? <laughs> so it's all gone, it's going away, uh, I mean I've got like a, a wagon of concrete and fertilizers and then a wagon of soil. So we're gonna give it an overhaul, it's, this is my budget friendly overhaul. I've been looking and looking and looking for probably about four months now. Yeah, actually since Christmas time, because I was gonna buy this at Christmas time, but I couldn't find a deal that I liked. Um, so I went on Walmart and I found a deal on Walmart, which blew my mind. I didn't even think to shop there, but all of a sudden I'm loving everything that Walmart is putting out, which is so funny. I didn't want to spend $3,000, $4,000 on an outdoor patio set, but I also didn't want to spend, you know, $200 on a patio set and something that wasn't gonna last very long. My arm got tired from holding you. I, I had to switch arms. <laughs> but I didn't wanna spend just, you know, I didn't wanna buy something super cheap, but I also didn't wanna buy something that was going to cost an arm and a leg. So we've had this current set for probably, we've been here for five years. We had it for about two years at the other house. So we've had it for like seven years. We've gotten our money's worth out of it. I think we paid like 300 bucks for it. Killer deal on it. But we sit in like two chairs and we don't ever have guests over, we don't have people over, so we don't use it, and it just takes up the entire patio space, where what I ordered is really, really nice, and I think that we will use it tremendously. And then we are going to, eventually, order a new, like, gazebo thing. This one is also, I think, like, four years old, and it was from Home Depot. Let me just turn the camera on and show you guys, because um, from a distance, it looks okay. <laughs> So this is the gazebo. I mean, it looks totally fine. I could just order a new cover for it, but I really want something that's wood and that's nice. There's a hole right there in it. Um, and then like on the other side, you can't even see. I don't think you can see on the camera. Let me go to the other side. Do you see all that like stainage on the top? It's just gross. It's really gross. So I would like to replace it. I would like to get something that's nicer. I would like to get something that's wood. The reason that if this panel and this panel, the reason that they're stained is because there was the branch from the privet hanging over right there. And like the berries would drop, the leaves would drop, the birds would be above it. <laughs> and so it was just a mess. So eventually, I'm hoping this year, this disappears, this will be gone. We'll give this to somebody, maybe Ashley or something like that. And then this table has to go. So if you come up to it, I mean, you can see, see how the paint is starting to bubble in some spots? and then it's like wore off to others and it's like chipping. And this is happening all over this table. So she is done here. Um, the cushions are just kind of drab and I don't want to spend the $300 it would cost me to replace the cushions and just still have a table that's kind of, you know, you know, it's it's getting there, it's, it's almost done. So I'm gonna gift this to someone. Um, Ashley has a friend who I think wants it. And so we're gonna gift it to her, she can take it. And I am going to replace it with something exciting. So step one today is to get everything cleared out of here. I think what I'm gonna do is move a lot of this stuff to the lawn, like this wagon is just gonna get moved over to the lawn. Um, and then like my seedlings and things like that, I'll move, I'll put stuff back in the shed, like the blowtorch. And then we will unbox the first box and wait for the second box to get here. <laughs> So 
So Ashley just texted me and she said that her coworker does want the table, which is perfect. And they're gonna pick it up today, which is even better. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna move it to the side yard just right here. I'm hoping that I don't need to like get in this way. We'll see. But I'm just gonna move the table and the chairs over to this side. That way I can like do the leaf blower and like sweep and get this all cleaned up. And then we're gonna set up the first package that came and then we're just gonna hang out and wait till the second package gets here. <laughs> Well, <laughs> it definitely got darker and now it's starting to sprinkle. So I ran back, I grabbed the chicken eggs, I put a few things in the shed that can't get wet, and I moved the cushions off the chairs that I had just moved to the side yard. <laughs> so I'm gonna see if it lets up. It says that it should let up here pretty soon. So we're gonna wait inside for a little bit and then come back out and finish this project. But we got everything cleared off. I would need to come in now, you know, with the leaf blower and whatnot but all the cushions are back over here. One chair is still over here because it has the leaf blower and a few things that'll stay here, like the cup holders and bug spray. And then the table and chairs are all down that way, ready to be picked up. Okay, we're back, we're back outside. Uh, I had to add another layer on because I'm a little bit cold, <laughs> um, but that's okay. It's like 47 degrees, which you guys know, my range is like 60 to like 70 at its like peak. It's like a 10 degree range. <laughs> Uh, it is raining. I'll probably get warm. I'll probably shed this outer layer in a little bit. So for now, I need to blow off the patio and then I need to bring the box that has the chairs in it from the shed up here so I can set those up. So let's get back to work, even though it's raining still. <laughs> Okay, so I started doing the cleanup. I took the leaf blower, blew everything out of here, and then I quickly realized that I should probably clean up these beds because they're not gonna be accessible very easily. And then I started raking everything out. Look at how much was in here. And you guys, this two by four right here was totally covered. You can see it's actually, this one back here is also covered. So I'm gonna have to work on that a little bit, bring that down. You can see, look, that's where we stopped the fence. Ugh. Anyways, got that section cleared out, that section cleared out, that section cleared out, and I haven't done those, and I'll do those later, because that's a little more accessible. Um, Yeah, so I need to take care of this pile now. And then I did rake a little bit in there, too, which is kind of nice to get a little cleanup happening. And then we obviously have this, which I think I'll take down once the couch and the chairs are here, which... Oh, there it is. So let's get this area cleaned up now and then unbox the chairs. The table and chairs are gone. <laughs> they came and got it. Uh, it's actually going to Ashley's uncle, which is perfect because he just bought a new house and he has a back patio, but he didn't have anything for it. So perfect. <laughs> and it is starting to rain more and more and more. <laughs> I thought we were done. <laughs> Even though on our 10 day, there's a day that says 80 degrees, which is ridiculous. <laughs> One down, one to go. <laughs> It took me eight minutes to get to this point, and honestly, I think like two of those minutes was literally installing this piece back here. So there's one on each side that goes in here, and it's like really far back there. 
so like your arm barely reaches okay it looks like on camera my arm is totally reaching it fine <laughs> but it's really hard because this piece and then there's this bar and it's like down in there so this piece probably takes the longest to install um the rest of this i've done it all with the tool that it comes with which is this little ratchet thing that it comes with and uh, i wanted to see how easy it was to use this because i know a lot of people just don't have a, all the power tools and this was actually really easy so i only have four more bolts to go in three of them will go in with this and one will go in with this so it probably takes like i don't know 12 minutes to do one chair super easy so um the instructions said it would take 20 minutes with two people to do two chairs I could see it taking like 15 minutes, two people, two chairs, each person works on a chair, gets it done. So this is actually really easy um, and it doesn't require too many pieces and you don't even need to have any power tools, which is nice. It comes with the only tool that you need and I wanted to make sure that I could do it with this tool. It would take me literally like minutes if I didn't have to use this tool. This thing is just like, keep cranking it over and over and over again. So let's get this last piece on really quick um, and then we're just still waiting on the couch which was supposed to be here two hours ago at this point. <laughs> Okay, we got the chairs done. I love it. Brent's very happy with it. And it comes with the covers that you need. So I really think it was a really great deal. They're looking a little less uh, gray on the camera than they are in real life. So they are pretty, so they are pretty gray in real life, but I don't mind it at all. It's not like a very bright gray. It's a very neutral gray. I, I'm loving these. And now we just wait for the couch, even though it is dumping outside now i mean it's pouring <laughs> so either way we're happy <coughs> oh jesus because he died right here on film <laughs> and it's the next day the storm is cleared and the couch did not show up yesterday at all and now it's here so we're gonna set the couch up today Well, this looks so good, and now we really do need to finish the fence. <laughs> oh, man. So the entire set, I think it was like $1,000, and um, two chairs, coffee table, and a couch. It's going to be hard to keep the dog off of it. Uh, Brent said that he already saw her today on the chair over there. He saw some feet prints, so we'll see what happens. But I am beyond thrilled with how this looks. To me, it looks like aged wicker, which is really, really pretty. It's a little more gray, and the cushions are obviously very gray, but I like the sides of it. They look like aged wicker, but it's plastic. So it's not gonna like be destroyed out here in the weather. And like, we are able to use our patio pretty much year round since we have this cover. And so we really needed something that was not going to break the bank, but also was going to last. And so I think that this will be a really good option, especially for the fact that it comes with the covers also. So we have a cover for the couch and we have covers for the chairs. And my thought was $1,000 for two chairs, a couch and a coffee table and the covers. It was way better than a lot of the other options that I was seeing. So I know it was expensive, still $1,000 is $1,000. Um, but I think it's great. 
and it's gonna make it so we want to be out here more. I didn't ever wanna sit at that table. I didn't like it. It was always just full of my clutter and it just, I don't know, the cushions weren't comfortable anymore. It just, it was very drab and it was not, it wasn't it. So I think this is a huge improvement. Next step is we're gonna get a TV out here because we had one um, that we had had hanging right here and it actually got fried a little bit. So uh, we need to get a new one now. <laughs> so I think we're gonna put the one that's in the living room out here and get a new one for our living room. And yeah, it's gonna make it so that we're gonna wanna be out here all the time. I think Brent's already talking about <laughs> working out here, doing his job out here. He got a new job for those of you that don't know. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I think this is it. It's, it's really, really nice. I'm very happy with it. Well, I think that is gonna be it for this video. We're gonna probably sit out here for a while and relax. Next step is gonna be, I, need, I would like to get some like pillows for out here, some outdoor pillows. And there's a giant hole right here. So I'm gonna need to get a plant, obviously, to go right there. So um, I think next step is gonna be like decorating this area. We're not gonna do a rug or anything just because we live in the country and everything is always so incredibly dirty. It's just, it's really awful. So these are sprayed, these cushions are sprayed with uh, Scotch Guard. So they're going to be able to hold up, which is really, really nice. They do feel like they've got Scotch Guard on them. I think it's like a pretty heavy coating of it, which is fine by me because I think it needs it. <laughs> so I think that's gonna be it for the video. I'm gonna sit out here and enjoy this and relax the rest of the day. I think we're gonna go pick up dinner and probably we'll eat dinner out here. We do have, it's still cold. It's still for us as I'm in shorts and a t-shirt. But we have a little heater right there and we have a fan that we replace that with in the summertime. So it's gonna make being out here that much more enjoyable. So I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I can't wait to go shopping now and get some, you know, a planter there, a plant there, some pillows. It's just, it's all gonna be so nice. A plant there. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.